citizens of this world, although they sometimes have nightmares, for none of them nightmares should become a reality. Snatched from the safe home of their parents, trapping in a labyrinth full of dead fear, confronting twisted forces for whom tormenting their victims is the only form of amusement. Every day, I have to fight with demons from the past. Flashbacks are still in control of my life. Distorted faces, gruesome riddles, decaying bodies, and a scent of fear have been ingrained in me. So I become entwined, just like my poisonous ivy. Sometimes I can't distinguish reality from the visions in my head. Am I dreaming? Maybe I have never escaped, and I'm still trapped. What have I done to deserve this repeating hell every single day? My name is David, and 15 years ago, I was kidnapped. Will you help me overcome my trauma? David? You look pale. Are you okay?
Remember, it's completely normal after all you've experienced. You will go through episodes of despair, sure, but what's important is that you don't lose hope. David, your abduction has left its mark on you. A mark which can't be erased easily, that's why I'm here. So we can work through this to get... I'll find you, boy! Hear what? David, calm down. The man who hurt you is gone. It's just you and me here. You're safe. Just breathe. Don't look around. Sit properly. Just breathe in. Breathe out. That's it. You see, the human mind, especially under duress, has a tendency to distort reality. It can make you see things that aren't really there. It can make you hear voices or notice hidden patterns. That's a part of... What do you mean? David, episodes of short-term amnesia can occur in patients with post-traumatic stress disorder. It's another symptom that makes me emphasize what I've been saying all along. Sometimes, you have to cut deep to find what you're looking for. But sometimes, you have to let it go. It's not about finding a cure. There's no magic remedy that will instantly heal you. But you do need to give your brain some space to sort through all this traumatic experiences on its own. We can try to find a way that would allow you to pick up the pieces in a safe, friendly environment. There's one place I know and recommend. Some of my patients stayed there before with great results. You can retreat there, forget about everything for a while, and if you need anything, I'm just a phone call away. You better hide, David. <laughs> Thank you.
antidepressants, a class of medication designed to alleviate symptoms of depression, operate on the intricate chemistry of the brain by modulating neurotransmitter levels, particularly serotonin, norepinephrine, and dopamine, they restore equilibrium to the delicate neural pathways that govern mood regulation.
Now sleep and remember, don't be afraid. <laughs> You have to cut deep with the 